Hello everyone, it's PCL Per here. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix sound issues for the game Mass Effect Legendary Edition. So a lot of users have been complaining about this problem that there is no sound in the game and some are complaining that they hear a crackling sound while playing this game. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix this in only two steps. So just watch both of these steps very carefully and perform them one by one. And if by any chance your problem is not fixed, then you can write in the comment section and I'll find some more ways to fix it. Also, make sure your graphic card has the latest drivers as this might also fix this problem. But if your drivers are updated and you are still facing this problem, then this video will most probably help you. Lastly, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, then you can subscribe now for regular gaming content related to this game and many other games. And now without any further ado, let's get started. So there are only two steps to fix this problem. So the first one is the most important one and it's not an advertisement for any product or something. It is just something that fixed it for most of the users and it is really convenient to perform. So the thing is I've already made a video on Driver Booster 7. It is a software that basically updates all your drivers in one click. It scans for all the updates available and updates them. So you can, if you already have some any other software then you, you can use that software to update your drivers in one click. But the thing is that not all your drivers are updated with Windows Update or your Graphic Cards Update because your audio drivers, display drivers, network adapters, there are many other drivers which are not updated regularly on your PC. So you can download any such software. So I recommend this software, I'll provide you the link of this video in the description. Watch this video, download this driver booster and scan for all the drivers and update your all drivers using it. Once you have done it, you have to go to this tools option in this software and as you can see, if I will zoom, you can you will be able to see that there is an option to fix no sound. You just have to click on it and if your PC has any problem, then it will detect the problem and that then fix this issue. So just download the software, first step is really simple. But the thing is, for many users, there are a majority of people for whom this step is not working. So then what you can do is you can just proceed to the second step. But still the most important step is this one. Update your drivers, go to tools and fix no sound using this driver booster 7. But still if you're facing this problem then proceed to the second step. So now the second step. So the second step is also working for many users and it works for most of the game. So if there's any other game on your PC which has sound problem then you can perform this step and it works for most of them. So what you have to do is you just have to right click on this speaker icon as you can see on your taskbar it is present and go to sounds or you can just search for sound settings and you will be redirected to this page only. What you have to do is here go to playback and in playback you have to select your output device. So right now are my Realtek audio speakers so just double click on it and here go to advanced and as you can see now you just have to apply the hit and trial method. By default there will be a bit and frequency already selected. Now you have to apply the hit and trial method that you have to select each and every possible option here one by one and see which fixes the problem for you. So for example by default it is on 24 bit and you are facing this problem where there is no sound or there is crackling sound. So what you have to do is you have to just just select the first option that is 16 bit and 44 for uh, it's what is it? It is 44 khz 44.1 khz. So just select it and apply these settings and click on yes and then try running your game. If you are still facing this problem then just select 16 bit 48000 hertz apply these settings and then click on ok and then try running your game. If you are still facing sound problem then select the next one and do it until you find the right frequency for your game and your PC which are compatible. So it is working for most of the users don't take this step for granted select each and every frequency one by one and it will most probably fix your problem. So the first step was where you have to update your drivers first of all then fix no sound using this tool in driver booster 7. In the second step you have to select each and every possible frequency on your PC and apply these settings and for some PCs you won't be having so much of options you might be having only four options so it will be pretty easy for you to figure out which frequency is better for your game. So once you have done it most probably your problem will be fixed but if you are still facing this problem then you can write in the comment section I will dig more into this topic and find out some more probable workarounds which are working for my other users. So thank you for watching this video if it worked for you then please leave a like and also don't forget to subscribe for more gaming content. Thank you and have a nice day.